So guys, I am back with another Diablo 4 video and today guys, I bring you possibly the best solo XP farm in this game and well, whatever else comes with XP. We have legendaries, we have those uniques, we have gold, we have ancestrals, just depending on the world tier you play on. This thing, no doubt, is one of the best solo farms in the game. Stay tuned. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and I'm giving away an ultimate edition version of Diablo 4. To be with a chance of winning it, simply drop a like on this video, make sure you are subbed and leave a comment down below. Now credit for this one must go to Isaiah13 over on my Discord who hit me up and told me about this one and told me to check it out. I did guys, it's incredible, so I'm bringing it to you thanks to this dude. Okay, so this is located guys at the top of the map, the very north. Uh, let's go there, we're in Scars Glen. And the dungeon itself is called Domhain Tunnels. It's located right here on the map. This is where you want to come to people. This is the beauty. It really, it's unreal guys. Now what's great about this is, I've just run the whole thing. I wanted to clear out the boss and that. You basically just have to free, I think it's six prisoners. So you just run straight through. Like one here, you know, obviously the RNG dungeons, the layout changes. But it's going to be the same thing anyway. So you release six of these. And the middle part here is where you actually progress through. So you run through all the enemies, guys. There are a couple of elites this way, that way, and the other. But ignore them to make it efficient. Solo XP farm. Free the prisoners. I mean, you can't miss them. You just run straight past them, grab them. Um, you probably have to kill a couple of enemies that are around the prisoners. But don't worry about them. I literally, as you're seeing, I was running past these most of the time. Freeing them. So once you got the 6-3, you come to this room here, guys. You have to take out, I think, a couple of elites. So easy to do, a few little minor adds too, take them out. But once you get to this area guys, there is a massive group, compact in a small area of elites, you name it guys, and you're seeing this on screen now. There's a ton of them here, and they're so, so easy to take down. Yes, they drop that loot, that gold, you get that XP as you would. And then guys, as you come up a little further, there's another little group. I mean, it's not as big as the first group, but it's another group. It's definitely worth your time farming. So come up guys and grab these two. It's a little quick instance. You can do the whole run easily in under like three minutes, probably even quicker, depending on how powerful your build is. You could run through these enemies. So in fact, you can run through the entire dungeon. I did it in six minutes. My build isn't perfect yet. So I'm still working on it. I ran through the entire dungeon, including the boss, in like six minutes. Guys, you could do this farm every three minutes, easy, without a shadow of a doubt. Then, guys, you just reset the farm. Uh, obviously, if you're a solo player, you just simply pull up your map and then go to leave uh, dungeon. Or go that way, press up on your D-pad. If you're playing on console, go to leave dungeon. Once you've left the dungeon, guys, you're, you're spawned outside of the dungeon door, obviously. Then, guys, you want to go to your menu, go across to your game. And leave the game once you've left the game simply re-enter your game you'll re-enter the game outside of the dungeon door simply enter the dungeon again all enemies will have respawned repeat the farm it really is as simple as that if you're playing in a team in a party it's even easier what you got to do guys is as the social as the uh the party leader go to your menu go across the social and click leave party which will be in here as soon as you leave the party you're well teleport to outside of the dungeon then guys, you re-invite all your friends or whoever's in your party back into your game. Then guys, you enter the dungeon again, rinse repeat the farm. It'll be even quicker in a party. It'll be absolutely ludicrous and the amount of XP you will get in a short amount of time is great. It really is. So yes, one of the best solo XP farms in the game without a shadow of a doubt. Use it, abuse it while you can because we all know how Blizzard roll. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.